I have a Yorkie, a Yorkshire Terrier, named Zoe, so she's my favorite. I like hypoallergenic dogs because they don't shed, uh, but she's really cute. Harry Potter. I went through a phase where I watched Prisoner of Azkaban, the third one, every single night before I went to sleep. Yes, absolutely. I sometimes show tunes, so I'll get a little Les Mis on, and, and that's, you know, my musical of choice. I dreamed a dream, maybe. I dreamed a dream in time. I could do Somewhere of the Rainbow. I was Dorothy in my school musical. Sure. sure. Okay. <laughs> when all the world is a hopeless jumble and the raindrops tumble all around, heaven opens a magic lane. I have also become obsessed with the new Cinderella movie that just came out recently, so my quote from that is, have courage and be kind. Have courage and be kind. Whenever I talk to little girls and give them an autograph card, I like to write have courage and be kind on there, just as a little reminder, and I think it's, it encompasses everything that I kind of stand for. So the person that comes to mind right now is Condoleezza Rice. She's alive, it could definitely happen. Just saying. But she uh, spoke at my graduation this past May at High Point University, and I loved what she had to say about education and growing up as a black woman in America and how, you know, her family really had to fight to have their education and that it's a privilege, not a right. So I'd love to talk to her more about that um, and be able to understand where she's coming from, um, just because I did have a taste of hearing her story at my graduation. So I'd love to get dinner with her.